his emotions yeah. on the sidelines. Talk about his enthusiasm, his, his incandescence, his motivational skills with his teammates. I don't think Ed isn't contagious. He got. If that's my major. It's a good thing to be close to Washington, D.C. Turner taking off. And that takes the pressure off a young quarterback. Looking at second down and two now. And drop the line more again. Cutting back and stopped up right around the. Oh, but he did miss a 35 yarder at the very end of the Connecticut game last week. Good point. That was Keon Lattimore. Under three minutes to go here in the first quarter. Lattimore again. has done a nice job. Seven to three. Maryland with the lead. Lattimore trying to get to the edge and now cuts it back. And stopped up at the 40-yard line. Picked up about two. Lattimore has been counting. It has a bunch of carries. Four runs on this drive alone. And that was the fifth. This right there, the fullback. Looks like he's sitting down in a chair. <laughs> you can see what's going on there. That's exactly right. So you can see those linebackers. And this time, ball stopped up behind the line of scrimmage. He's going to pinch inside, but he's going to redirect back out and make the play, and he makes Scott Burley miss. Watch this right here. Pinches inside and then swats him with that outside arm. The thing I love about Chris Long, watching tape on him, he defeats blockers. You know, in this day and age of football, Mark, it's all about defensive linemen just running up the field, rushing the passer. He can do both. Both starting offensive guards over there on the bench right now for now. Jack Griffin comes in to replace him. In the backfield, ball with a catch and brought down. Has used his one coach's challenge. Second down and ten for Chris Turner. Hands it off the ball, running between the tackles. And he got one of those low jack instruments on him to keep track of him with your Maryland. He's got four tackles tonight. Not the ball. <laughs> Some whining going on, no question. <laughs> and this is a carry. With nowhere to go for Lattimore. Lattimore dragged down Chris Long, starting to get that engine revved up a little bit. Hey, Mark, I don't want to put him in the Hall of Fame just yet, but this play by Chris Long right here is phenomenal now. Beats the block at the line of scrimmage. Now watch the closing speed in the effort. He in number 30, Nate Lyles. Be this productive, man. A 3-4 scheme that Virginia plays. Working on that sequence. Five minutes to go in the first half. Turner with time, and it's batted down at the line of scrimmage for the second time in this game. And Chris Long was in the neighborhood again. It might have been him. Again, Mark, they lined him up over the guard. Phil Costa this time. See him over the guard? Swim move. Then the fullback steps up to try to pick him up. You can go ahead and put him hey, in the Hall of Fame. He's going to win some <laughs> hardware tonight now. Is it the... <laughs> Lattimore between the tackles after the 14-yard. Thank you. So this is a good opportunity to launch that time right here. There's the play fake. <laughs> and a sack back at the 10-yard line. Chris Long. And a derisive sign of the L that uh, Lattimore put up when he scored a touchdown a few moments ago. A little payback there. And Mark beat the double team. Watch right here. They double team him. He is going to split the double team. And they got two blockers on him right here. Now watch. Both the guard and the tackle. That's about 700 pounds that he just split that double team right there. And look at Long. The L also stands for Long, not Lattimore. These two teams are pretty good rivals. On the draw play. First half. I love these replays. Let's watch Costa right here on long. Invites him up the field, but you know what? Shotgun. Three receivers out to the top of the screen. And Ball keeps the handoff out to the 36-yard line. Chris Long was the first Cavalier. In the second quarter to make some plays. Yeah, Mark, and he continued it. 
after halftime. He just made a heck of a play right there, taking care of the inside gap on the tackle, then bouncing outside and making the play right there at the start of the second half. Lining up over the weaker guard, and maybe overheard some of that. <laughs> Anything for motivation, this time not as much success on the ground. Who else? Chris Long on the stop. Well, I'll tell you what, the backside, Chris Long on the inside pinch move, Mark, and they, the tackle, Scott Burley, 77, had no chance to cut him off. Watch from the backside. And you know what? One thing comes to mind. Don't know if he'll be back at this point, but definitely we'll keep you guys posted. All right, Stacy. Ball stopped up the flag thrown the play. Stop here for the Cavaliers would be huge with respect to field position. The Terps hand it off, and they're going to come up. Chris Long and his emotions on the sidelines. Talk about his enthusiasm, his, his incandescence, his motivational skills with his teammates. I don't think that isn't contagious. He got 53 hopping a little bit over there. <laughs> 53 hadn't hopped in here. Safety. Chris Long rocked his world. Mark, that's that inside move again. He came inside on Scott Burley, then Zach Griffin, the new offensive guard. Watch right here. He's going to come inside over Burley, and then the guard's going to try to block him. He just beats him again on the inside move, Mark. Burley, the off guard, and did he plant? Wow. Wow. Oh. Fast night. Second down and seven. Latimer again looking for a C. Nice cutback. Cutback. I run the football. I run the football this way, away from number 91 right there. A little jailbreak screen. Oh, nice move by a kid.